Welcome to Redbeard and the Den of Tools. Hi, ho guys and gals, it's Red, your friendly neighborhood tool bear. And we are back with more new stuff from Harbor Freight. Yeah, we got more unreleased stuff. If you thought the uh, the welders were going to blow you away, wow, have I got something for you today. Now, you probably guessed it based on the thumb, but let me tell you, it's Goldilocks season right now. We've had the good. We've had the best. But it looks like they're filling in the blanks with the better categories. They're bringing in the brands. They're going to fill in the gap between the uh, the stuff they've had before and the new higher end stuff they're bringing out now. Now again, let's throw a big like, thumbs up, and a share on this video to say thank you for all our insider bears inside of Harbor Freight doing the deed. Yes. Many boffins died to bring us this information. In the beginning, there was Chicago Electric at $179.99, and it was good, but we all, we all wanted for more. And Harbor Freight was good, and they gave us the Hercules, and as the bear showed you last week, oh, it was good. But still, that was a big gap, even when it's on sale, from $300 down to what was the sale price on the Chicago Electric, usually around $130. That's still a big gap for those in between. And a lot of people are saying, you know, I want something a little bit better, but I don't know if I want to spend that kind of money. Well, our great overlords have heard you. They know that there's something missing in that Goldilocks zone, and they have brought you a solution. Say ahoy to the Admiral. Yeah, there you go. List price on it's going to be two ninety nine. You know, it, it really is exactly what I say. It, it's a little bit better than the Chicago Electric, but doesn't have all the bells and whistles and, and let's be honest, build quality of the Hercules. But for many of you, that's not going to be an issue. You just want something a little better, something to up your game some more. Let's see the actual information our, our Inside Bears agent Deep Freight brought us. Now, these are actual screenshots showing the... Uh, potential inventory for this we got a skew number 64686 12 inch dual bevel sliding uh, compound miter saw of course they don't have any in stock as of yet but we can see the list price the msrp on this is going to be 299.99 uh, with a $30 one-year extended plan and a $50 two-year plan well with a little digging the bear was able to come up with this now this is from the manual. I'll have a link for that in the video description below. But as you can see, this has a lot of the same, you know, concepts to it that you see on the Chicago Electric. The handle's pretty much the same. The motor's the same placement. The rails look pretty much the same. But there's some add-ons there. The wings are definitely enhanced over the basic uh, Chicago Electric 12-inch, uh, much less the 10-inch. We've got a, a new control design there on the front on the miter lock knob with the uh, the bevel lock lever and the miter detent lever. And we've got the laser now uh, mounted above the saw with an LED work light uh, located closer to the, uh, the pivot point. And this just brings to mind a saw that many people have been asking me to take a look at. And that's the Cobalt. And if you look at this, I mean, the Cobalt's priced right there also at $299.99. It's going to be a fairly similar saw. They're going to be right swinging at the same uh, at the same fences, if you will. Speaking of comparisons, this color scheme and form factor and everything at this kind of price level really runs the bear of the old uh, Craftsman 12-inch sliding miter saws. I don't know. What do you think? It's pretty close. I mean, yeah, the motor's on the other side, and it's slightly different and all, but it uh, sure kind of harkens back to them, doesn't it? Anyway... That's all the bear has for you today. Just wanted to get this out for you. We got more information coming every single week. Be sure to stay tuned. And if any of you want to be an inside bear and send us uh, some cool info over to uh, the den, you can always email me at red at red-beard.com. And we're looking for stuff besides Harbor Freight. If you find new stuff showing up at Lowe's or Home Depot or Menards or anywhere else, you know, be sure to send it on over. We'd love to see it. All right, that's it for tonight, guys and gals. You take care, and as always, shine on. Thanks for watching the video. If you'd like to help support the channel, the easiest way is our 1-2-3 method. First, chomp that like button, give us a thumbs up, spread the word with a share, and subscribe and ring the bell. Remember, if you don't ring the bell, YouTube doesn't really believe that you want to watch the videos. But maybe you'd like to take it a step further. Maybe you want to go over to Patreon and consider subscribing to the channel. For only a dollar a month, you can become a Black Bear member and help support the Den of Tools.
Also, YouTube now allows us to sell merch directly on each video. Yeah, if you scroll down below the video, right where you see the description right below that, you should start seeing a little pop-up window that shows you some of the Denna Tools merch. Or pick up a copy of the Home Distiller's Workbook, your guide to making moonshine, whiskey, vodka, rum, and so much more. And we still have the DeBear shirts available. Links to those items, as always, are in the description below.